Dear students, I welcome you all to this tutorial series in digital electronics. I am solving the problems from the book Digital Design by Morris Mann and Michael Seleti. So in this video, we will solve the problem number 1.16 from the chapter number 1. The, this problem has four parts A, B, C and D. The first of all, we have to find out the 16th complement of this hexadecimal number. This number is in hexadecimal okay so first of all let us find out the 15th complement whenever you have to find out the r minus 1's complement write the maximum number with four number of digits in hexadecimal and then subtract this number from the number okay so the 15th complement will be f f f f minus b to f a so we'll get 4 d 0 5 so now let us find out the 16th complement. 16th complement. For finding out the 16th complement, we have to add 1 to the 15th complement. 4d06. So this is the 16th complement. So the first part is over. Okay, this is hexadecimal number. Second part is convert b to fa into binary. So in case of hexadecimal to binary conversion, we have to convert each digit in this hexadecimal number into its 4-bit binary equivalent. Okay. So b to f a in hexadecimal will be equal to so b means we can write in binary as one zero one one then two zero zero one zero and for f we can write one 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 and for a a means 10 here okay so it is one zero one zero so this is the binary equivalent and then part C. Part C. Find the two's complement of the result in B. That means this is the result. We have to find out the two's complement. Let us first find out the one's complement. One's complement. Okay. Then we will add one and we will find out the two's complement. So in the previous video, we saw that for finding out the one's complement, we just need to invert the complete binary number. Okay. So it will be 0, 1, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1. 0 0 0 0 then we have 0 1 0 1 so this is the okay one's complement now let us add 1 to this number and we'll get the two's complement two's complement will be 0 1 0 0 1 1 0 1 then we'll have 0 0 0 0 and 0 1 1 0 because it will be 1 plus 1 it will be 2 okay so this is the two's complement in binary now the next part is convert the answer in c this is the answer in c and we have to convert it into hexadecimal and compare this hexadecimal number into two's complement in the first step so let us first convert the answer this one into its hexadecimal equivalent so the next part is convert this conversion is done okay and compare the results to the answer in a this results is the same as that of the answer in a okay these results are the same okay so thank you for watching if you have any question please put it in the comment section below also like share and subscribe to my channel thank you